Hi, welcome to Paul Paul's Workshop. Today I got a brand new product I want to show you. This is from the same company that I've done the reviews on before, but now they've added a brand new feature onto their receptacle. It is called the Power Delivery, or in short, PD. So today I want to talk about this new receptacle. Let's get started. The first thing that I want to mention on this outlet is that it does come with the cover itself. And I like that feature because it means you don't have to go out and buy the cover separate. So this is what comes in the box. And the first thing I want to talk about is just the simple design and the construction. This is a very sturdy, hard case. And it's very well made. Now granted, it is made in China, but it is a well-made product. And in looking at this, the first thing is the power outlet here is a tampered resistance. Now this is a 15 amp, 125 volt uh, receptacle that is used standard in the US. And this has the tampered resistance, meaning that you can't easily stick anything into here because it has that little plastic tab to prevent the child from sticking something into the outlet. Now this is the outlet that I had reviewed before and I'll put a link up top to be able to let you go back and refer to this one. But this outlet has the two USB charging outlets and these are 5 volt DC and they are rated at 5 amps. And this is a quick charging uh, system and I use this in the shop all the time and I keep the cord handy and close by so I can just plug it in and charge my device. Now I use Apple products so I have the Apple connector to be able to plug in to my iPhone and my iPad but I use this in the shop just about every day and this does work extremely well and it charges my devices very very quickly and that's important in the shop because I'm doing so much videotaping that it's important to be able to keep the devices charged because they do run down at usually the worst possible time. Now this receptacle is tamper resistance and these two AC outlets are 15 amp 125 volt uh, rated and that is great for what we have for the United States. They are tamper resistance, meaning that you have a little tab, and I'm not sure if you can see that in there, but there's a little plastic tab in each of these outlets so that you cannot inadvertently stick something in there and get hurt. So this helps to prevent it from a child from getting hurt. So I like that feature. Now I'm not going to put this into the wall outlet today but I do want to show you just how easy and simple it is. It is clearly labeled on the back for the hot wire and in the United States that would be the black wire and then on the other side they have the neutral. In addition to that you have the screw colors. The screw for the hot wire is going to be the gold color and on the other side for the neutral is silver. And that gives you another way to be able to identify which one is hot and which one is neutral. So in addition to being written here, you have the color coding here. All you need to do is loosen the screw and slip the wire into one of these holes. It has a little gauge right here to be able to get the wire depth. So you know exactly how long to be able to cut it and then just slip it into the appropriate hole, tighten down the screw and you're done. As far as the ground wire, the ground wire we attach here and again it's color coded and it is green. So it's very simple to be able to put the correct wiring together on this one. So I would very much say this is a DIY type of an outlet. 
But again, if you're in doubt, hire an electrician. Safety is always the most important thing, so be safe. Now, let's talk about the two charging ports. First one I want to talk about is the USB. This is the Type A port. It's a USB port, and it has labeled here QC 3.0, which is for the identified that it is a quick charging USB port. And this charges at a 5 volt 3 amp. Now then, it does sense the device that you plug into it, so it can also charge at 9 volts and 2 amps, and then there's a third option where it can charge at 12 volts at 1.5 amps. So it will have the technology inside of here to be able to identify the best charging rate for your particular device. The next charging port that I want to talk about is to the one that's labeled PD. Now this is the new. I've actually looked around at several of the big box stores and at some of the other places that sell the um, power cords and the receptacles and they're really very, very hard to find if you can find them at all. So this is very new. This power delivery system is called a type C port and it is a 5 volt 3 amp as well and it does have the same capability as the other USB port in that it will sense to the device and it will regulate the uh, output for it. So it can be at the 5 volt 3 amp or it will go to the 9 volt 2 amp, 12 volt 1.5 amps or the 15 volts at 1.2 amps. So that allows for it to be a wide range of pr different products that it can use. Now on the back of the box itself, I'm going to try to get this in the camera where you can see it, but it lists out a lot of the different items. This lists out a lot of the different products that you can actually use in this. Whether it's an iPad, iPad mini, for the tablets, the Blackberries, the Android phones, Windows phones, the Kindles, Nook e-reader, so it's got the Galaxy, the Bluetooth headsets, iPhone, iPods, digital cameras, and other USB compatible products. So this is something that you want to make sure that your product is going to work with this. Now you also have down here 2015 Apple new MacBook and you also have the 2015 Google Chrome book. All of these will work with this. But with all of this information, you can actually check your manual for your device and see if it is going to work. And here's all the technical information that I had given you a moment ago about this particular outlet. So if you're like me and need to charge your devices quickly, there's nothing better than having these types of devices. This manufacturer does extremely well, and I've been using the one that I showed you earlier now for quite some time, and absolutely love it. So much better than having to find not only the card, but the little charging thing that plugs in, then plug it into the outlet. That's just crazy. So I'm very happy to have this new plug, and I wanna find a place upstairs in my house to be able to put this in. Now this product from SCICT Manufacturers, this product is available through the Amazon. And I'm going to put a link in the description below where you can purchase this receptacle. Hi everyone, thank you for watching my video today. If you like the video, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button down below and the little bell next to it so you'll be notified on the different videos that I upload. Also check out the videos over here to be able to stay up to date on the happenings in my shop. So again, thank you for watching my videos.